Hello everybody! Welcome back to Paper Mario the A Thousand Year Door. Today we have the fourth chapter of the game. Because, man, this game is long. And we're going to Twilight Town, so let's just head off right into the pipe. And man, I do not like wearing these headphones without time having being on, I'm realizing, but too late. Today we are entering chapter four. For pigs, the bell tolls. I have no idea what that means. I have zero clue. Like, I don't know what that means, but it's definitely going to be interesting. Let's go right off into it, shall we? And figure it out. This looks like Twilight Town. Oh, that's nice. It's directly at Twilight Town. There's not like a pathway I need to take before I can actually go here. That's definitely a plus. This, uh, this place gives me the creeps. Is this Twilight Town? Hey, it's been a long time since anyone come from outside. You've come from far away? Yeah, those clothes of yours. I'm pretty sure you guys must be adventurers, right? This is a bad time to arrive. Wait, but you're adventurers! Maybe it's the perfect time. Wait, what? A bad time? What do you mean by that? Come on, tell me! I don't know what's going on, but... Oh, gee whiz, I don't know. It's a scary tale to hear. And scary to tell, too. This is just like the core world huh the little creepy world with pigs for some reason because pigs mean creepy oh no the bell rang again oh this is awful who could it be now oh okay so it's turning random citizens into pigs isn't it whoa that was the craziest thing i've ever seen what's going on in this weirdo town oh badness now poor gloomer got turned into a pig not good <laughs> this dude who are you gramps i'm the mayor of this poor town some call me door hey andrix i'm not exactly the sharpest fellow but i do believe you're adventurers right this isn't the place for the telling of tales sadly come come to my home we're starting the fourth chapter finally that chat is super delayed but you know my traveling friends welcome to twilight town well I'd like to welcome you, but welcoming people is generally a good thing, and it's nothing but bad here. As you may have guessed, our town has been cursed. Oh no! Whoa, cursed? Yes, cursed. That is the right word, you right? Yes, of course it is. You see, yon town is a forest, and in its heart is an ancient building. The creepy steeple? Steeple? The dark creature who lives there, its curse ordains that when the steeple bell rings, one of the twilighters living here in the village becomes a pig. <laughs> Will my loved ones become swine? Will I too become a curly tailed oinker? I'm so worried I can't sleep at night. Of course night and day are pretty similar here. If this keeps up, well. The village will be one giant pig pen, which would be bad. <laughs> Let me give you some advice. Leave us. Leave before you too. Get pigified. <laughs> I'm, like, I'm like trying to make this really serious, but pigified. Not gonna happen, Gramps. We're looking for something really important. Maybe you've heard of it. It's a car sh star shaped rock called a crystal star. The selection of words is so goofy, I know. Uh, I don't know about any crystal star thing, but in creepy steeple, there's a glittery red stone shaped like a star. Whoa, are you serious? That's gotta be the crystal star. Gotta be. Uh, you people, you aren't thinking of going to creepy steeple, are you? Steeple? I keep on changing the way I'm saying it. Brr, unthinkable. Well, too bad, we're gone. And yes, this place is like... Not scary, but I mean, they're getting turned into pigs. So, so if I want to head, oh, I can talk. Cough, cough, cough. Okay, birds. You never know when there's something hiding in one of these bushes, like a fire flower. Oh, my inventory is full. Um, man, I don't know. Is there a shop around here? Ooh, thank you. A revive. A star piece. See, I knew there was going to be one around here. So that's an inn, but not no shop. Who lives in this house? 
Who are you? Hello, sir. You're still not a pig. Living in this dark place is so depressing, you know? I don't really care if I turn into a pig or not. Oh. Sorry, dude. <laughs> You're not having a good day, huh? Let's go save these people from their pig situation. Their swine conundrum. Their, uh... The croinkage. Oh, hello. You guys have different looks. Mommy, I'm hungry. Food, please. I haven't been able to feed. To buy food for my children since my husband turned into a pig. Now they're all so hungry. What should I do? You, got, you want food? Kind traveler. If you have some spare food, could you share it with us? Of course. Do I have food? <laughs> Can I give him a hot dog? Okay. There you go, lady. Have a hot dog for your children. Oh, thank you so much. You've made my children very happy. And me as well. It's not much, but please take this as thanks. What is that? Oh. That's actually a pretty good move. Oh, and kind traveler, where do you hail? Oh my god, that's so, <laughs> that's so unfortunate. The poor child, hey, pitch my mommy, Oh, Are pigs good? Oh god, don't eat your, don't eat your mother, child. You're a piggy. Don't eat your mother. Do not do that. That would not be good. In this village, the moon is really all we can rely on. You can even grant wishes. Don't let me turn into a pig. Don't let me turn into a pig. I'll even give up bacon. <laughs> Damn, that's some commitment. He's willing to give up bacon. Anything over here? Nope. Who's crying in the item shop? Oh, they turned into a pig, huh? Oh, a customer. I'm sorry. We're not open right now. My husband turned into a pig. <laughs> oh, why am I crying? My husband's been turned into a pig. <laughs> okay. <laughs> a pig. <laughs> My husband went to the woods yesterday to collect herbs, but no husband came home. Instead, a pig returned. This pig! We got into a fight before he left, and I'd call him a Chavinist pig. And now he really is a pig. He has a sweet side too, like hooking my favorite something. And when shopping get rude, my husband, ah, it's a wonderful thing. Go and, I wish you couldn't dip into a cola money. Oh, it's a wonderwear radiator. Often I tell him cotton, tough, it falls to make hands on, throughout the pigs. Yeah. Okay, I got all that. Um, are you even listening? You went kind of quick. So, hey, could you figure out some way to restore my husband to normal? I'll do whatever I can to help. You can even take whatever you want from the storeroom if it'll help, you know? What storeroom? What's that? The storeroom's locked? My husband must have taken the key with him and lost it in the woods. Ah, okay. So we gotta look for a key somewhere and we can get into the storage room. That seems easy enough. Too bad we don't get an actual shop, though. Did I talk to you already? I've been thinking lately. I want to be a big one. Because what's the point in being a pipsqueak pig, right? Gotta embrace the pigginess. You tell him, dude. Embrace your pig self. Ah, okay. That's the only way we can go. A nasty monster lives in the woods past here. I'm serious. That's what somebody said. If you still want to go through, even after hearing that, you need the mayor's permission. Oh, man. The old monster beyond the town gate thing? Isn't that kind of cliched? You gotta be kidding me. Fine. Let's go ask. I think not. Yes, I'm a novelist and I read several books a day. Not all pop-up books either. I wonder if pigs can read. I'm a bit concerned about it, to be honest. I don't get why we can talk to the crows. They don't seem to have much to say. We gotta have an item of, of somebody else's name on us for it to let me through. What? Whoa, the bell rang, Gonzalez. Does that mean somebody's gonna... Boy, I'm psyched. It wasn't my turn to get pigged. <laughs> it would be so funny. If we actually do get pigged. I'm actually kind of looking forward to it. Did the inn get pigged? No. I'm good. I was hoping you were going to be a pig too. Alright, did the mayor turn? The mayor turned. I knew it. Whoa, this ain't good. Dude, don't you think that pig is the mayor? What are we going to do now? We need that dude's okay to pass through the gate. Just bring him. Oinky, oinky. So where could I... What do you think I need to do? 
Hey, uh, Goombella, what's what's your face? Since the mayor's a pig, we can't get his permission. What should we do? Block him with the gatekeeper, maybe? Okay, I can go ask the gatekeeper. Maybe he'll actually let me through, I don't know. Oh my god, he turned into a pig. Whoa, the gate guy's gone! Oops, nope, not gone. The stubborn dude's a pig! Well, hey, that's actually pretty sweet for us. No pig's gonna get in our way. You're so right. Bye, pig. Sucks to suck, ha- Okay, let's leave. The Twilight Trail. This rock is suspicious. Can I blow it away? I forgot I used the abilities. Okay, no, I cannot blow this rock away. Are you sure I can't, like, push it or something? Oh, there you go. Oh, the strange black- ch Wait, what? A strange black key needed to open a strange black chest. Like, the- the chest that unlock the secret things chest? Why did that one just break and disappear? What? I expected something different. Okay. Green Goomba. You struck first. Now if I use hammer. Super hammer. It's only 1 HP and FP now. I upgraded. Well, I didn't upgrade it. I just changed what I had. Oh, wait. I don't have these guys uh checked yet. What is... What is that? Oh, it just increased its attack power. That's nice. Stop you. That's a rock. Wait, okay, so I want you to tattle on Hyper Goomba. Hyper Goomba? That's what they're called? It's 8 HP to attack. Got it. That's not too bad. If you can't beat him, then run away, okay? I think I can deal with it. Uh, maybe I can deal with it. There you go. Perfect. Just enough. <laughs> I don't want to use you, so I'll use you, super hammer. Okay, that did not do nearly enough. Head bonk? Easy. Oh, thank you for the mushroom. Alright. Never mind. Can I just use you? Yes, I can. I would have really appreciated that, uh, shop. Because I don't have inventory. <laughs> just get rid of one of the normal mushrooms. Ooh, para. Hyper para. I should have switched. Let me just tactic swap partner Goombella so that I can not tactic tattle on you. And he's gonna have all the same exact things. 8 2, yeah, whatever. Not that. Gotta just kill him right away. Although we're missing a turn. What's that? Oh? Attacks will now miss. That's actually kind of OP. That's actually really bad for me now. <laughs> Um, really? That's all that power lift does? It just increases your attack and defense? Let's use the Earth Tremor, because what? By some lucky chance, this will even hit the invisible one. Kind of doubt it, but, you know, it could happen. It looks like he got damaged, right? It did damage. It didn't even kill him, though. It didn't kill either one. <laughs> they do really have a lot of health then. Damn. Eh. That was... Decent amount. Okay, whatever. I mean, I'm fine. Poor Goombella's a little bit hurt, but you know. What are you thinking, Goombella? This is more of a Twilight. This is more of Twilight Trail. A lot of enemies around here, seems like. Hey, by the way, Mario, is it me or has the moon been getting bigger? Not that I'm scared or anything, really. <laughs> has it been getting bigger? I have not noticed that detail. Okay, this is another one. I'll just have Goombella out. <laughs> Are you kidding me? <laughs> Come on! <laughs> that was such unfortunate timing. Super hammer them. I don't know when to press it. Tattle. Hyper spiked Goomba. 8 and 3. Just a little bit more of attack. At level 9 attack. Great. Yep. I'll be fine, I guess. He's leveling up. He's also leveling up. He's also- okay, everybody leveled up, that's nice. The guys are a bit of a threat. I'll give him that. Maybe I should have checked- oh wait, I have Quake camera, what am I talking about? Okay, come on. Please come out. Good! Nah, I didn't kill them all! Ouch. No way. I got lucky. I guess? No, not really, actually. I guess defend. There's nothing else you can do. Eight. Eight. Damn, that's a hard attack. Just use Quake Hammer again, and honestly, I might go back to the inn. Wait, did I miss them? 
No, okay, I guess I'm running. <laughs> Man, these guys hurt. I did not expect these guys to be as challenging as they are. Those guys hurt. Like, they can pretty easily one-shot my... Well, not one-shot my team, but one-shot Mario. If I'm not paying attention. I guess I'll take it in. Stay, whatever. It's better than getting myself killed. What's this? Punish 1 HP and 2 FP? But why is it peachy peach, you know? Like, why is it that specifically? Okay, let's try this again. Right there back. Got you. Now, um... Quake Hammer! Kinda wish it did a little bit more damage. It actually does not do a lot of damage. Huh? It only does three. How nice of the game to just give that to me. Gulp him? No, I'll do Ground Pound. Easy. And he does five damage easily. You're powering yourself up, whatever. I can just go jump on you. What are you gonna give me? Please let it be the XP points. Ah, oh, nice. Okay, I'll take that. Because I'm actually gaining some star points. Paratroopa, I'm guessing, is next? Are you kidding me? There you go. <laughs> Why do I suck at aiming that? Then here I might as well use the Quake thing. Earth Tremor. Again. I wish it did kill him though, but these guys are pretty beefy. Like, I'm surprised. But no, they are pretty good. And I wish he could attack the other one. But I'll have to deal with the Mushroom dude. Which better not heal himself. He probably will, huh? Yes, he did. Well, you know what I think about that? I have no idea when to press the button for that one. But, you know, it doesn't matter. He's still dead. And now the next guy's a little bit more difficult because I can't jump on him. But if I go ahead and do Super Hammer, it should kill the first one. Yeah. I can have you do Gulp. Go. Didn't kill either one. That kind of sucks. <laughs> oh, whatever. I guess this one. Stylish. Never mind. Just drop it. I thought I could sense it. I get. I sensed wrong. Oh look. Roink. How do I get through you? I can see something just past down the down tree. Ah, smart, smart. I would not have thought about that. The key that opens the door to the storage room in the shop. Let's go bring it back to the shop then. I am not fighting the dudes again if they respawned. I'm gonna run through them. Okay, good. It doesn't seem like they respawned. <laughs> Sorry, lady. Imagine the husband's actually just alive back here. Oh. God damn it. <laughs> I really wish my inventory wasn't full. Hold up. Hey, who's there? I just heard a voice. There's no way that people could be here. Seriously? That's just so unlikely. Huh? What's that you say? You've seen a chest like this before? Get out of here. No, no, no. I'm, I'm not like the old chest, I promise. Look at my eyes. Tell me I'm lying. You're lying. No, I'm seriously not. Just get me out of here. You'll see. Don't make me beg. I'll take you out. What? Come on. You know how ridiculous you sound right now, right? I'm laughing in here. You honestly think I'm going to curse you when I get out? Curse you? Well, I don't plan on doing something to you, but it's not as much a curse as a... Well, a really wonderful new ability that will allow you to go special places. Doesn't that sound nice? Oh, yeah. Oh, come on, please. Just find this key and open the chest, okay? I know it's near this town somewhere. I just can't go looking it for it myself because I'm in here. So, pretty pretty please. I have the key. Wait, is that? Oh my, oh my, you already found the key. Oh, happy day. Here you go, chest. We he fools. Oh my god, it's happening again. Now you're cursed, loser. Save your suffering. When this curse strikes you, you won't be able to walk. You'll be forced to roll around as a tacky tube. Your suffering amuses me, and I so I laugh. Ha 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 ha. Now show me your cursed flight so I can laugh all the more. Your presence holds the R. And rotate this repeatedly? Oh, cool. Your pathetic misery thrills me to the core. When you're in that form, you must roll everywhere like some embarrassing extruded wheel. I want to get a good look. Long look at you in this pitiful form. Now roll. <laughs> <laughs> well, do you see how pitiful and tubular you are? When the suffering becomes too much, press B to revert to your normal self. Don't forget how nice that he gives us a way to un uncurse ourselves. That's so sweet of him. 
I understand my eternal cylindrical agony. I understand that I am cursed for ages. I will never be the same. Never ever. I guess use this so that I can get rid of it. 50 FP is insane. Who's And I don't know what to get rid of, you know? I feel like that PT Peach is important for some reason. Ooh, a defense plus. I kinda like that. You open the storeroom, I see. Feel free to take whatever you want out of there. It's a good trade for a chance to get my husband back, I think. No sense in fretting, though. I should get the store ready for business. I sure wish I had my husband back in normal form to help me run the place, you know? Do I have a... Okay, nope. You're still not running it. Any chance I can walk out? Walk back in? And it's set up? Nope. Th that was wishful thinking. Okay, let's just leave. Come on, let's go back out of there again, I guess. Rogue Port today. At noon today, the Express Express. The Excess Express ran late for the first time in 10 years as a suspicious incident activated station security measures. Area Yoth and huge train enthusiast Lockie was found taking pictures in an employee-only area near the Express and was gang-tackled by local Samaritans. I understand how much people are into trains, but we got safety and security measures to uphold, blustered the train engineer. The Yoth, the youth, was released with just a warning. This time. Hot dogs, cool. Fresh juice, cool. Okay, what? I don't know what that means. Let's go, Yoshi. I should fight a couple of these just for the experience. Even though they're kind of annoying boss fights. Boss fights, not boss fights. Fights. Honestly, maybe I should re-equip the multi-jump. Let's do this. Because, I mean, I need to get rid of items <laughs> since I don't have the space to be carrying more. And this guy's sure is dead. Easy. <laughs> now I will like to sweet treat. I mainly want the flower power, but whatever I pick up, it will be good. Damn it. Except for that. No, the flowers! Ah, oh, damn it. They're putting them in the most unfortunate spots. I gained five. That was not that great. Eh, kind of. Good job, Eggie. Now just you. I might just skip that last one. Again. Like, if I do, it depends on how close I am to leveling up. I am at 75. I mean, I am kind of close to leveling up. Maybe I should. It's so annoying to fight, though. Take that. Oh, wait, what is this guy? That's not the usual dude that shows up. Actually, what is that? <laughs> Swap partner from Goombella, I guess. And then tattle on this thing? Crazy Daisy? <laughs> That's a crazy daisy. It may look totally cute, but it's a serious foe. Max HP is 7, attack is 2. What you gotta worry about is it's lullaby. It, that tune will totally zonk you out. If you manage to guard well, though, you might not pass out. Try to learn the timing. Oh, and when its HP runs low, it runs away, so try to KO it all in one spell swoop. Interesting. I did not expect that kind of thing, eh? Okay, I gotta kill that guy. When do I... Okay, I was not even close. <laughs> Honestly, not even close with the timing for that one, but I'm glad I still got to not get hit by it, killed by it, whatever. He's dead. And then you, uh... I don't have anything good. Uphill. Guarded. Okay, that was just bad in general. I do not know how to time that move. Alright, Goombella's asleep now. Ooh, bingo time. That's not a... Man. One day, I like... My timing is so off on that. Double points, please? Yeah, let's go. I love that. Why did I say six? I don't even know. Now we're off. Hey, I see that star piece. So what's going on over here? This seems blowable. Am I right about this? Yes, I am. Awesome. Okay, let's go down. Nothing over here. I'm just too curious. Where did I go? Oh, just a completely new area? Okay. Ah, no, it's the Crazy Daisy! <laughs> take that, Crazy Daisy. And then, take... Um, uh... The Super Hammer. No, that kind of sucks. Let's take a spin jump, because honestly, he might just run away. Didn't kill him. But I can just head bonk the high... I'll head bonk the Crazy Daisy, fine. Yeah, of course he's doing that. Great, I'm kind of at a bad spot now. 
super hammer? Uh, it did decent, but I don't know. That's just, uh... Yeah, fine, just use Thunderbolt on him, why not? What else am I gonna use it for, right? A boss fight? Nah. Ooh, what's this? Oh, cool, the earthquake. Oh, there's a block over there, I need that. Gotta catch them all. Let's kill that other Daisy. Come on, Daisy. I Why did I still stay as the girl? I'm like realizing I shouldn't have. Let me just swap partner for Eggy. And Eggy, you wanna gulp him? That's kind of a bad move, not gonna lie. I'll use you on them. Not bad. I feel like the first one's gonna run away. But maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I guess I'm wrong. <laughs> I have no idea when to guard that. Ah, there we go. I think I might know now. So you're leveling up. Whatever. You're attacking. Thank you for making that easy on me. Now, super hammer. And I'll gulp the next one. Perfect. Did that not kill the first... Really? That didn't kill them? Damn, okay, my bad. I thought that was gonna kill them too. Sweet treat. Come on. I'm like, I was about to hit the wrong thing. No, I did! <laughs> Please come back. Perfect. Going good so far? There we go. I feel like that was almost perfect. Hey, it's going pretty good. How about you? And I got just this one, which I guess I got a gulp. I just have no... That was not what I meant to... That's so dis... <laughs> okay, I messed that up a lot. <laughs> like, yeah, that was pretty bad. Nah, I'm, I'm not even gonna lie. Don't hit me with that. I guess I'll use normal hammer. And then I can use gulp again. <laughs> I'm so disappointed that I accidentally left go. Go, that was awful. But I leveled up. Nah, I don't even know what to level up. Realistically, I should do FP. What if I just do BP again? Like, what if I just do BP again, you know? Like, what harm is there in that? I don't even use FP that often, like... I'm such a- I'm such a bad RPG player. Why, do, why am I doing this to myself? Um,